in Greco Roma. I didn't start wrestling Greco Roma until about 1995. So within five years, I had to catch up to them technically. They were better than me. But the thing that I had was what was called positive affirmations. I'm a better conditioned athlete. I work harder. I'm more dedicated. I have more perseverance. Those are the things that helped me win. And I came out, and Steve Frazier, as you know, said, You're going to break it. You got him. You got him on the ropes. I'm like, Okay. Confidence. And I went out there and I made a decision. I'm going to start to throw. And I started inbounds, went out of bounds, went onto the wood floor, then I threw him. Because I didn't want him to counter me and score that third point. When I threw him, I landed on my head. He dove the opposite way, put his chin open, finished through points, no out of bounds. I got up and I'm seeing birds, I'm looking around and I'm having a hard time standing up. And Frazier's like, you gotta look at him, he's bleeding. And I looked over, he's bleeding. And Frazier's like, get broken. And I questioned myself, I said, did I believe? I said, no, I didn't break him. I didn't do anything. I'm losing 2-0 with a minute and a half left in the match. Frazier, what are you talking about? But he saw something. And I had the confidence to follow him and his belief. And I said, yes, I did break him, and I'm going to break him again. And I came back within 20 seconds, I scored my first point. Within another 20 seconds, I scored my second point. We went into overtime, two to two. My opponent was so physically tired that he couldn't stand up. He was out there, and they would have to actually pick him up and help him back to the middle of the mat. And I'm out there having an underhook. He's blocking me. I chase around the mat, the mat, and the referee said, caution. I won the match because it cost one. First time ever. Came out there, I won the match. I'm walking into the finals with Corella. Best ever, 13 years undefeated. Hadn't been scored on 10 years. Well, that was fun. No, I'm gonna go out and do my best. Guaranteed a silver medal. Why not go out there and reach your potential? My potential was to be second best, that's fine. But I was gonna give my best effort. I wasn't gonna walk out there and say, you know what, you beat me. Great job. I'm going to go out and say, you know what, you earned this victory. I didn't give it to you. And I walked out there, and we walked, and we talked to the coaches, and we came up with a strategy. Get in his face, push him, make him feel like you're better shape, you're better conditioned. When we walked off in the mat, we walked out to the mat, he was physically stronger than me, bigger, more powerful. He manhandled me like a toy. But what I had was I had unpredictability. He didn't know what was coming. When he would grab my arm, I would have pressure. I would hit him with something quick, and he would have to be stunned a little bit, so he'd have to try to come back. And I would keep moving, I'd keep pushing, until he got to the point where he started getting tired. When we went to the clinch, Carell locked me up. He had me. If he would have committed 100%, the match would have been over. But he didn't. He made a mental mistake because he didn't finish what he started. Because you have an opportunity, you have a chance, and you have to go for it. Don't think it's going to come around again. If you guys have a chance to make it in the state tournament, make it and win it. If you have a chance to make the Olympic team, make it and do your best and win it. Don't give up on yourself and doubt yourself. For me in that match, I didn't give up. I was down, I was working, I was working in every position, and I came back and I scored my first point. 1-0, first point, 10 years crown been scored on. I look up and I say, okay, great, now what? I'm going to wrestle. I'm going to continue to wrestle. Because that's what I prepared for. How many people do we know went out there and were technically, physically, everything else better than the person and they lost? Because they gave up on themselves, because they quit, because they got cocky, because of all those little things you made. Have you done it?